Andreas, Comval is famous throughout the industry and been around for a long, long time. What's the latest development of the technology? Yes, for sure. So uh, you probably know we developed a reliability prediction index for Conval to predict reliability for valves for single cases. What's new now is that we can do that in engineering projects and with a huge number of cases, 500, 1500, 2000, not a problem. So we can ensure that under the tremendous time and cost pressure that you have in engineering project, you still are able to have reliable sizing and selection of your instruments. Now that all sounds very abstract, can you perhaps give a concrete example? Yes, we, we just did a, a pilot project with a big uh, North American owner-operator. They had a project uh, build a new olefins plant and so the typical scenario is uh, you have at least three parties, owner-operator, EPC and instrument vendor and we stood in the middle of the communication of uh, these three parties and monitored all sizing and selection processes for the control valves and thermal wells and uh, the result was that finally uh, all instruments that have been chosen uh, to be purchased by, by the uh, EPC were sized properly and correctly so that there's no risk on uh, startup delays or damaging on, on valves during startup and commissioning. How do you see the future for these kinds of tools in the coming time? For me, there was a reason why we developed these uh, kind of tools, because what we saw that owner-operators are not satisfied with the way of uh, engineering is done today. Quality is a big issue. We saw projects where they had millions on, on cost due to delays and production loss, and uh, I think the only way uh, to improve that is to do effective engineering, and effective engineering is only possible in applying tools and that's the reason why we focus on that.